thank you for watching my video today and thank you ahead of time for subscribing do that and give it a thumbs up if you like this video so today I'm gonna be talking about how I took my dry old rusty chandelier from this to this fabulousness right here it was pretty easy and it was cheap y'all know I like it if it's on the cheap easy it's something anybody can do just keep watching and I'll show you how it's done it's easy don't forget to like it and don't forget to subscribe thank you guys thank you so much for watching my video bye see you at the end of the video so this is everything you were going to need so we have here some string crystals which I got off Amazon we have the drums and we have this pendant this crystal pendant this is super cute you could use this for an earring I'm telling you guys don't tell anybody I told you but you could some people actually use it as earrings it's so pretty and I have a glue gun which I got from Walmart it cost less than 20 bucks I don't know it was super cheap and I have a string here so this string is really useful I just took a little bit of it and I attached it to one of the pendants just one and um, if you see it just keep watching you'll see what I did with it and the crystals came as a pretty long string but I cut it to length so you have to measure out your chandelier and determine how to cut it you don't want it to be too long or you don't want it to be too short it has to be just a little bit longer than the arches of your chandelier when I start putting it it will make sense to you and I also have like some little hooks which I got off Amazon as well I just put it attached it to the strings it makes it easier for you to hook the strings to the chandelier like I said it's gonna make sense when I start doing it so I chose gray for the drums because it makes sense because it, it goes with my decor and I like dark colors I guess but you could choose pretty much any color you want. They have so many colors, so many designs. You can get it off Amazon, Walmart, you know, your local store. So you can get this and just jazz up your living area. It doesn't cost a lot. Everything here costs less than 50 bucks. It's amazing how it turns my chandelier around. So keep watching guys and let's make this old chandelier into something nice and beautiful. Well, I'm gonna clean it using a regular spray cleaner. You can use Windex or whatever you want. And I have a paper towel. Just spray this and clean it down. Just clean it. Just wipe it down. So now that your chandelier is all clean, I'm gonna go ahead and begin to attach the crystals. I'll begin with this. So you guys remember I told you about the little hooks? So now this is how the little hooks come in handy. So I'm going to take one of the strings and I'll hook it right here on top of the chandelier. Can you? I hope you guys can see what I'm doing. I just hook it right here. Can you see that? And I'm going to hook pretty much all, all at once, so just to save time. I'm, I know you guys are busy. So I'm going to hook this here. So I have five of these, five arms, I guess. That's what you can call it. So I have five strings of beads, one for each arm. So you want each of the strings to fall in between two arms. So I'm gonna put the last one right here. And here you go. So because of the hooks are nice and hidden up here, nobody can see it. Nobody knows you're gonna use any hooks. So it's pretty nice and neat. So, so this is a tricky part. So I don't have hooks here because I refuse to make a hole. This is an apartment. I'm not trying to get the landlord to take my security deposit, right? So I don't wanna drill holes in here. Another option would be for you to drill holes and make and hook it in here. But I'm just gonna use the rings on the string. I'm just gonna open it up and hook it okay uh, this is a bit can be a little tricky when you try to do it the first time so here you go i just hooked it so this is going to be nice and safe it's not going anywhere especially when you use the glue gun to secure it just tap it put a little glue right here on top of it and it's not going anywhere and this glue dries clear so nobody's going to see it so i'm just going to go ahead and attach everything So 
here you go. You see, guys, it's already looking really nice. So the next thing to do would be to attach the pendants. So we have the pendants right here. That will be the next thing to do to put this pendants. So I'm going to put two pendants for each lamp. So you see. So I'm going to do it the same way. I will open up the rings and attach it to the sides of the lamp or the lamp holder. So just open this up, open up the ring and hook it. To the side. Uh oh. Okay, I'll try this once more. Here you go. That's it. So I'm gonna put two for each lamp holder. It just jazzes up the whole thing and makes it look really pretty. And it costs less than 50 bucks super cheap girl I am trying to spend no money on this apartment I mean I'm spending money on my apartment to make it look good but you know I'm not gonna break my bank <laughs> I'm trying to go rob a bank or something maybe when I buy my own house then I can do whatever I want to do with it to finish I'm gonna show you what this is for you remember the single pendant that I put the string still this is a string they are already attached it to the pendant so this is where it goes I put it right here in the bottom and I wrap it around because this string is so tiny nobody's gonna see it except the person is really looking and if someone is at your home to look at stuff you should, you should tell them to go nobody got time for poke noses <laughs> So this is it. Just wrap it around really nicely and wrap it around and there you go. Okay, I'm just going to go ahead and finish putting this up and you'll see when I'm done. So this is the finished product. It looks so pretty. It looks a lot better than it was before. So thank you guys for watching and don't forget to like this video and subscribe and leave comments below. Thank you guys. Bye.